Welcome to Salto. We are happy to have you here. The first thing you'll have to do is connect your Salto account to your NetSuite account, and I'm here to help you do just that. As a quick overview, here are the steps we will be taking. On the NetSuite side, we will enable and install the Suite Cloud Development Framework, if it's not already. We will ensure several required features are enabled. We will install the Salto Suite app, and we will create two separate authentication tokens. On the Salto side, we will create a new environment and provide that environment with the NetSuite account and token information. Note that you will need to repeat this entire installation process for any NetSuite account that you wish to connect to Salto. Let's get started by logging into the NetSuite account we want to connect to Salto. Once we're logged in, we can navigate to Customization, Suite Bundler, Search and Install Bundles, List. In the list, we want to look for Suite Cloud Development Integration. If it's already there, like it is here, you can sit tight until the next step. If it's not there, we need to install it. You click New, search for the word Suite Cloud, select Suite Cloud Development Integration, and click Install. And that will take some time to install, so we will move on to the next step while we wait. We need to make sure that the required features are enabled. So we navigate to Setup, Company, Enable Features. On the Suite Cloud tab, we want to make sure that several features are enabled. First, create bundles with Suite Bundler, SOAP Web Services, REST Web Services, Token-Based Authentication, and all the way at the bottom, Suite Cloud Development Framework. With all of those enabled, you'll need to accept any terms and conditions and then click Save. Next, we will install the Salto Suite app. Do that by navigating to Suite Apps, searching for Salto, select the Salto app, and click Install. Now, this will also take some time. So while we wait, we can check in on the bundle installation. Navigating back to customization, suite bundler, search and install list. We can verify that suite cloud development integration, its status is complete. Once it is complete, we are ready to create a token for it. Navigate back to your home screen and select manage access tokens. Click New Access Token, select Suite Cloud IDE and CLI. This might also be called Suite Cloud Development Integration as the application, and click Save. This is the token that will be used by Salto for the Suite Cloud Development Framework tool. Now, either leave this screen open or copy and paste the token ID and secret values and store them at least temporarily, you will not be able to see these values again. Should you happen to lose these values before connecting this account to Salto, you can simply repeat the process, create a new token with the same settings and use the new values instead. Open the home screen in a new tab and click Manage Access Tokens again. New Access Token, this time select Salto Integration as the application and click Save. This is the token that Salto will use to access the Salto Suite app. Once again, either leave this page open or copy and paste and store this ID and secret value. And that is everything we need to do in NetSuite. Now we switch over to Salto. In Salto, create a new environment by clicking the plus button next to Environments. Give this environment a name. You will be able to change this later. We'll call it NetSuite Production. Click Connect an Application. Select NetSuite. You may be prompted here to install a plugin. If this is your first NetSuite account connection, 
Go ahead and install that plugin to your Salto account. Provide your NetSuite account ID, which you can grab from any NetSuite page in the URL. Next, we provide the token information for the Suite Cloud Development Integration token. This was the first token we created. And then we provide the token information for the Salto Suite App token. This was the second token we created. Depending on your account type, you may be prompted for the team permissions. Selecting the first option means that each individual using Salto will need to make their own tokens. And selecting the second option means everyone using Salto will use the same credentials to access this NetSuite account. I'm going to choose the second option and now connect app and fetch. Once all of that is complete, your Salto account is now connected your NetSuite account.